In terms of leadership aspirations, um, it's something I haven't really thought about at all until probably the last couple of weeks, just because it's been, I guess, spoken um, around the team a little bit um, in the media. But I think it's up to probably Payne and, um, you know, probably JL to, to pick their player um, that they want. But I think we've got some great options in the team at the moment. Um, you know, we've got, I think Joshy Hazelwood would make a great, great leader. And he's already a senior man around the job, around the, around the team. You've got Mitch Marsh, Pete Hanscom, um, and Ilzi Kwaja, who are all state captains. And you've got someone like, you know, Nathan Lyon, who's played 80 odd tests. So we've got, we've got plenty of um, leaders around the group. Uh, individually, I'm, yeah, I'm really not sure, to be honest. Um, I feel like, especially the test matches I've played, I've, I'm always pretty cooked out on the field. I bowl my overs and then um, all, all I'm thinking about is you know, trying to get right for my next spell and not thinking too too much. I guess big picture kind of kind of things and then once I'm off the field, um, yeah, I'm just worried about batting and, and trying to, I guess, firstly relax and get my head around batting. So, yeah, I, I feel like in a really good place at the moment with my cricket and, and where, I, where I, I guess, sit in the team. But, um, yeah, I, I'm really not sure what, I guess, a vice captain kind of role would involve. I haven't really been in that kind of position for a long time. So, yeah, I, I think first, first and foremost, I wouldn't want it to affect my cricket. So, yeah, I, I don't have huge aspirations. I think if it came up and um, yeah, I was I, I was wanted, then you know I'll think about it. But yeah, I reckon there's probably some better options in the team at the moment.